And we're back with yet more Osiris Wrath. <coughs> yeah. Loading. There we go. There we go. I was about to say it has, has to load all them graphics. Oh, yeah. Even then, the frame rate is kind of... <laughs> You know, I kind of wonder if this runs better on 360. I wonder if this is the one game that Microsoft beat Sony at. I don't know. Well, Bayonetta beat them. Oh Bayonetta my god, better on the 360 yeah. than it is on the, P on the PS3. I don't mm -hmm. know about PC, though, so hey. You let me handle Will PC is better than everything? Thank you very much. Yeah, I have a Pentium 2. It's way <laughs> better than your PS5. <laughs> Look at it play Crisis without any crashes. <laughs> Or without any animation. Oh, hell yeah. Or textures, or graphics, or text, or sound. See. If anyway, we're gonna go take down an entire armada. Let's do it. Oh, hell yes. Oh, I knew it! <laughs> I was wondering why you punched the ground, and then it immediately came to me. He's gonna use that as a ricochet. He's gonna jump into the sky. Uh... Oh my god, this entire armada is screwed! Oh, they're so fucked. <laughs> See, look at that! That was just by one bullet, the other ones were just overkill. It's like you're trashing apart your little brother's Lincoln Logs or Lego <laughs> sets. <laughs> just a slow motion kick through a Lego city. It's all coming down. Oh, this is beautiful carnage. Oh, look, look, defending ship. I wonder if they'll be able to do anything. No, of course nope. not. They just get close to me and they explode. <laughs> they can feel the intensity. They can feel the rage. All right, let's blow this thing up. And... Don't know what that did, but okay. Well, you had to, you know curl up and then unleash your arms just to bust through a hole. Okay, so maybe this ship's a bit too big to destroy single-handedly, but uh, hey, we can always destroy it on the inside. Oh, hey, Calro. Oh, that can't be good. Whoa. Whoa. Ah, how terrifying! They're waving their hands around! Oh, they're spirit-bending. What? Uh, commencing exorcism is more like a firing all cannons. Jeez. Kind of a foolish move, I think. You destroyed your flagship, which is already not smart, but, uh... Didn't work, either. Yeah. I am now six-armed Osara. You can't take me out that easily, dude. Someone turned on the thermostat! <laughs> oh, Osara's going into dad mode. Somebody touched the thermostat. <laughs> Who did it? <laughs> I like it as a pleasant 74! Why is it 75? <laughs> and then the entire armada burns to the ground. Well, we're about to do that, so, uh... Oh, sweet. Oh, yes. I, I was hoping it would be just, like, an open arena, just blast everything. And I really hope that big ship in the back with the easily grabbed nose there, we use that and swing it into every other ship, because I really how, want that to happen. How about throwing missiles back at other ships? That oh, good enough for you? that is just perfect. That'll tide me over. Oh, oh if, that's, health. Mean, that's health. That's uh, health losing. Uh -huh, yeah, you're you're actually losing health. I see it this time because I can actually see Osra getting hit. Because I uh, forget to go off of unlimited mode, and uh, well, <laughs> also these uh, missiles appear too fast. I can't hit the button in time, so I gotta like sit here and wait for him pretty much. Oh! Boom! Oh, there's another one. Oh, I actually like tracking these bullets just to see which ship they're destroying. Let's see if I can't throw another missile. Oh! Oh, yeah. oh well, no, you can't. It's right in the face. Oh, there, there we, we go. go. Woo! All right. Boom. Mm. 
Oh. Oh. Nick of time. Uh, I think you missed a scream there, ADV. Do that, or it's one of those angry, silent screams. Well, he's going like super fast. You know, it's kind of hard to scream out air when air is like going right into your pipe. You know, so it's kind of like. Ah, ah. <laughs> Do you think Osara can scream in the dead of space? Oh wait, he can. Oh yeah, you can have conversation with people in the dead of space. <laughs> oh. Oh, right in the face. How is he gonna survive this? And then you see Osara, and then little number two appears over him, and then it goes away. And then he just touches the ship, and then 9999, he just explodes. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, uh, status report. Oh no. Status report didn't do shit, sir. Alright, now I'm pissed. All of those other times? Uh uh. Wasn't pissed, but now I am. I've never been more pissed than I am right now, at least today. I always understood Asura as a gentle giant, but now why is he becoming enraged? Is that a mechanical eye or just a button? I'd like to think it's the equivalent of, like, Yu-Gi-Oh's Millennium Eye. It doesn't do shit except when the story says so. Well, it, it never does shit. Well, maybe it's just... Well, you know how Asura has six arms now, and he's kind of, like, got... Play attachments. Maybe that's uh, what'd you say his name was? Kauru. Uh, Kauru. Kauru. Maybe that's his clay attachment. Now you're just gonna destroy shit. Holy shit! That was awesome looking. <laughs> <laughs> Jeez. Cause I got like six of the motherfuckers in my range. <laughs> Ooh, they're bringing out the big guns. The literal big guns now. So how this part of the episode's gonna work is that uh, we're not just fighting to build up our first gauge, we're, there's actually enemies we have to destroy and we can move on. Oh, it becomes a beat-em-up. It, it, a little bit, yes. See, here's the bling, bling, go, go, little symbol. You gotta wait until you get your limited gauge up so you can actually open the door, but we got a limited anyway, so there we go. Off we go. So if you didn't have that gauge that you have equipped right now, would you have to continuously fight enemies until you had it full? No, I, I just have to wait until my heavy attack comes back. I oh, spoke. okay. Because I have unlimited, I have unlimited heavy attacks, you see. Oh! Oh my god, that was awesome! <laughs> That's I think his entire skeleton vibrated uh, and shattered. Yeah, exactly, it turned to liquid there. But, uh, I actually do like that in a lot of anime fight scenes. A punch so powerful, it stops everything, and then you have the impact afterwards. I just think that's really what? cool. Oh, but that's like a fucking... That dates way back to, like, the 70s and martial arts films with Bruce Lee and all that. Oh, yeah, I know. I just... I still love it. It's, it's always done well, in my opinion. Even though it's old as time itself. Well, I mean, that's pretty cool, too. Punching the ground and creating... Not only a shockwave, but a blast of light. Oh man, he punched so hard that light appears. You literally <laughs> punch his lights out. Dude! Sheesh. Uh, not only means that you killed him, but you actually created light for going so quickly. <laughs> you, ever, you know how he could punch faster than the speed of sound? Well, he just punched faster than the speed of light. Holy shit, these deities are screwed. Oh, man. It's just one guy. <laughs> With six arms! Oh, that's oh, a gun. Oh, that's a big gun. A big guy with a big gun. His name Tyson is... Tyson Nudo. <laughs> his name is Tyson? Oh, well, yeah, we killed his brother, Mike. All right, and, and you know, Tyson is such a desk job name. His, his name has got to be something more sophisticated, maybe with three extra syllables. Nudo! Yeah, there we go. We, we can accept that. Nudo! Yeah. Hi, my name is uh, Nudo. Oh, nobody's going to remember that. I'll just call him Tyson. Your name is Nudo, huh? You seem to be wearing clothes, though. 
You know what? My parents decided to call me this. Not out of spite, but because they were really fucking stupid. God, I'm having a problem here. I'm, I'm losing health of, like, a lot, so... Would you stop uh, dying? <laughs> I, need, I need to get my burst up post-haste. So you can take out Tyson. Ooh! Tyson chicken nuggets. <laughs> An impact so deadly it actually caused the frame rate to dip. Oh, oh God! God. <laughs> Thought I could have got him before then. Come on, there we go! All right, maybe a little bit more just to get a couple of heavy attacks. Can I hit anything from here? Nah, nah, Absolutely fuck it. Absolutely not. Yeah, screw it. What? Oh, Whoa! Whoop. Shit, I didn't get it. I got lagged out. That was a lag spike. I got lagged out. I, I didn't make it. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, what dear. Dirty, what a dirty trick, Tyson. Well, at least it was the TKO, so all That's you like needed was that one ear, punch. Man. I didn't know that was a mechanic in Osiris Wrath biting the ear. How dirty! In the mantra chamber. I wonder who it could be. Hmm. A rat again. That's a pretty big rat. There's no way it's Osira because he died in that explosion that I saw him die in. Wait. He's done this before. Died and returned. I wonder if he's back. What a strange machine. Ooh, I bet you I know what it does. I was just thinking a soul harvester. Uh huh. Guide them to heaven. You son of a bitch. Yes. <laughs> Perfect response. Yeah, dialogue's pretty good in this game. So simplistic and yet so wonderful. It's part of the reason why I chose the English dub over the Japanese dub, because Japanese dub's fine too, but, uh, I don't know. It's just whenever you do the screaming right, you put more effort into it, and it just... You get a better performance out of the whole deal. <laughs> you gotta love Liam O'Brien. Guys, Besides, friend. besides, a lot of these actors have a great pedigree behind them. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Liam O'Brien, Tara Strong... Robert Atkin Downs, Robin Atkin Downs, sorry. Harry Walgren. Yeah. And, and there's also uh, uh, this guy. He's dead, though. No, oh, well, he still did pretty good. Still, everything is just real good about this game. And uh, just going to build up the burst a little bit more, get these uh, heavy attacks up a little bit, and uh, now I think we're about ready. Ding, 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 ding. Go here. And boop. No lag spike. Not that time. Because now i got to get a whole shit ton of excellence if I want to get my synchronization right up. Because of that lovely miss. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm waiting on? I'm waiting on the one, the one soldier to actually trick Asura. To where he goes to, like, blast open a door, okay? He's moving ultra fast just to burst open a door. The guy opens the door and Osara just flies straight through and falls out of the ship. The only one who can really take Osara <laughs> is Yasha. Well, true. Uh, what if Yasha did that just to be a douche? I mean, not even a guy the size of Jupiter could take down Osara. <laughs> and he went down in one punch! Uh, that is a good point. I, I'm, <laughs> I still want to see some, like, Looney Tune shit happen in this. I know it would be dreadfully out of place, but I, it would still be really funny. Yeah, Osara grabs Kalro and throws him <laughs> off the ship, and then you just see Kalro freeze in midair. He looks down and holds up a sign that says, uh-oh, and then he falls. <laughs> I can see it. I can see it happen. Whoa, what the? <laughs> oh! Where did you come from? <laughs> oh, thank God you had that triangle there. Yeah, at least I didn't get lag spiked, out of, lag spiked out of that one, you know? Jeez, I was just thinking, that soldier was like, he'll never see it coming. And then all of a sudden, one of the arms just looks up. You know, all of his arms have like a mouth. They, they're they doing the mouth thing, the puppet thing. One of them looks up and goes, oh, hey, a dude. So two of the arms react, pick him up, and he's like, oh, no. Mother. Or it's like you're sleeping at a frat house, and one of the frat guys thinks it'd be funny to jump on you to wake you up. <laughs> But you lift your fist up just so, and you nail him right in the stomach. 
And then you, and then when it happens, just shout. <laughs> it's like it's happened so many times at the frat house that you're just unfazed by it by this point, and you know how to counter it every single time. Again, Chad. It's the eighth time this week. Choose a better tactic. That could have gone better. And mm -hmm. we're going for a ride. Oh god, metal on metal. Gah. I also think this is a good satire against those uh, ridiculous yet mandatory video game cutscenes where you have to go up an elevator and fight enemies. <laughs> it's like, fuck that, we'll just go up our way! <laughs> this cutscene's going on too long! Oh. Huh. Hello! When you're the ultimate dad. Oh. Ah, shut up. <clears throat> ah, fuck! Is he a hologram again? Yeah! Damn it! You got away again! That's all he ever does is just sneak out to the rat. Now he's gonna blow up his other fucking battleship yet again. I think they may have taken out some other ships in the process. I mean, those he guys were just going to work. Yeah, and he gets away in a skate pod like a shit. No plan, no oh, it's a monocle. Oh, God, I didn't even notice. <laughs> Except... Oh. oh, my God, yes. Yes. It didn't fucking work. <laughs> The world's angriest spider. <laughs> I think at this point it's just stubbornness. This spider bro is no bro of yours. Oh, yes! Yes! <laughs> do it, do it! I'm gonna give you a big ol' hug. Little more! Come here, buddy. Yeah. Oh, God. We're almost there. Soon the Goma will be no more. After the great rebirth, no more will need to be sacrificed. Yes, the world will be free from the threat of the Goma. He's just saying whatever he wants him to hear. <laughs> oh, I love that line too. <laughs> so let's fucking. Oh, yeah! yeah! Oh, God, that was great. Oh, poor Calro to suffer such a crushing defeat. Asura for Smash, please. <laughs> oh, there go the arms. And that's how you make Calro juice. <laughs> squeeze let uh squeeze gently. Just give him a big old hug. Oh my god, this hurts so much. Oh my god, I'm on fire. Ah. So now it's time for our next fight. Oh <gasps> not fear. You will not die yet. I think this is where I stopped. This is where you stopped? No 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 no, wait. I think it's in like one more chapter. Then I got distracted. <laughs> well, fortunately, we're going to be showing everything that this game has to offer. Yes! Copyright notifications by Capcom be damned. Hello, Capcom. I hope you're enjoying the show. Love your work. Make better games next time, please. I'm not mad. <laughs> Add more characters to Ca Marvel vs. Capcom Infinite. Thank you. Yeah. Take Resi 8. Anyway! Hey! Oh, how? I don't nice! Know how. I have no idea how, but I did. <laughs> okay. But I did. I, I think it was all those heavy attacks, and that's it's got to be a special attacks. Well, even that's then, your synchronization rate was at 90%. Uh, let's see, it, the cutoff point is 90%, so. Well, awesome. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. So, all right. Satoshi Sakai again. 
Oh, beautiful work. So now there's only four generals left. August is uh, taking care of us right now. Hmm, okay. I was about to call you out on that, but yes. This is like this is after we just blew up Calro. They're like, "Dow, dow, man, damn it! You believe that? He t- I can't, I can't even believe he's done this." God, Calro owe me twenty dollars. <sighs> so August, our master, thinks that he can take us. Asura has defeated another of the seven deities and is one step closer to getting his revenge. The next to appear okay, is I do his remember own master, this part. August. He speaks of days long So, uh, okay, next up is the fight. Next up is the swimsuit power. hot spring episode! <laughs> <laughs> See you next time for some steamy fun! <laughs> <laughs>